What's up guys, welcome back to our channel, it's Z and Abs and Zavis Project We're bringing you back another episode on this lovely Audi A3 S Line Black Abs, it's been a hell of a, well what can I journey. say, it's been a hell of a journey This is part 3, of, yeah, part 3, episode 3 So just to recap, part 1 was uh, sorting the mechanical issue out, wishbone drive shaft, oh that was a headache, wishbone control arm But finally we got that sorted The uh, second episode, part 2 we got the front bumper, the side, the uh, passenger side wing, the headlight bracket, the wing bracket, bumper support. That was all done, resprayed, you know, prepped up and all that. And that come up beautiful, just like OEM finish. It was brilliant. I enjoyed doing that part too. And uh, if you take you around the front of the car, a little tour. We also uh, got the roof lining, airbag. Side airbag. Curtain. Yeah, side curtain airbag. Well, that was all sorted out. Then we put it back together. Obviously, we still need to hunt this front seat down. It's uh, one of the S-Line seats. And then coming to the front of the car. And that's the front headlight bracket. Brand new, look at that. And uh, parts on this, obviously, they took time coming, but they're here. They're completed. So that's that done. Now, for today's episode, I think we're going to be working on the rear quarter. Abs, what do you reckon? Yes, rear quarter, rear bumper. What we're going to do is we're going to straighten the rear bumper out first. Once we straighten it out and obviously heat it up and push it out as much as we can, then we're going to see how much of shape we can get out of it. Yeah, it was a slight, slight process, same process as the uh, front, front bumper, bumper we did yeah. on the part two where we heat it up from inside and we pushed it because obviously it's plastic. And then see little, these little uh, heads trying to sort Yeah, so what, out, sand down, prep it up. Yeah. Uh, so I think first thing we need to do is remove, as you know, before we remove the bumper, Oh, so we just straighten out what we yeah, can. Yeah, let's just let's show them that little trick we did with the uh, probably one of the previous videos. The micro we did. Uh, yeah, the the dentless, uh, sorry, paintless, paintless dent remover. Yeah. Yes, that's the one. So let's try to do that as much to the bumper. Obviously, we can't do the rear quarter because that's metal, but that's plastic. So let's do as much as we can during there, and then what we'll do once we've taken as much as we can, we'll remove this bolt, try to remove the bumper away from the quarter, and see if we can heat it up from behind and. Uh, Pull it, you know, remove the dent and make it straight as possible. So yeah, this is it. Abs has got it. Abs has got it. Look at that plunger. The, the best tool ever. This isn't a toilet plunger. It's a uh, painless dent remover for any car, and it works like a treat. So let's get the kettle heated up, boiled, yeah, and then let's crack on with this. Yeah. Hopefully, guaranteed dent remove. Sanded down, so what we've sanded down, you see this little there were flaky paint here, so we've kind of sanded it blended all in. So when we start fiberglassing, at least that won't chip off now. So you can fiberglass this deep end over here, so at least that it like goes in and comes back out. So you want to get flush like the curve. So we've got the first part of the fiberglass filled in uh, and we've started to dry so we started sanding it down so what we've got now is we've got the skin made up so with that little ditch was going down and then up now it's got a nice smooth kind of flow going on so we still kept the line there for you I don't know if you can focus on the camera this one levels up with the headlight and this one just kind of goes here towards this line here I've kept the line 
So now what we've done is we've sanded down as smooth as possible as we can. Everything from here is blended in. So all we're going to do now, we're going to go for another slight little fiberglass filler here just to fill all this up. Sand that down again and then go over it with uh, body filler or fine filler, which uh, we see hopefully which goes good for us. And I blend it all in and then yeah, the bonnet's ready as well. So uh, once we've done that, then obviously we're in the wing. We've already started the bumper already. Bonnet's been done, working on the rear arch. And then once we're done with all of it, all the prep work's done. And then we'll head towards the uh, spray part of it. Woohoo! The abs have done a brilliant job. Look at that. The bonnet is looking oof. OEM spec, nice and straight. Look at that, perfect. So far, so good. Yes, so we've sanded it down. Obviously we put fiberglass, we sanded it down. Now this black mark here are your low pitch. Uh, we did do the guide spray. Uh, so this are the low pitch. And now we're gonna just do one more uh, part fill it, let it dry and then sand it. And then obviously once, hopefully we get the level we want, wet sand, blend it in and then prime and spray. And coming back to this rear quarter, even that's looking nice and straight. Still got a bit of, um, too much of a curve going in that needs to be pulled out. I believe from one this side here, one this side here, and then we'll have to do something over here, pull this straight. And then there, after that, it should really line up. So uh, I think first things first, let's move over to the front and then we do the rear. then we got the front end of the Audi A3 back together the front bumpers on the front wings on uh, the front wings got base coat hasn't got lacquer front bumper is complete lacquer base coat and the bumper is looking absolutely perfect look at that perfect match with the OEM color we did spray base coat and lacquer on the bumper we'd give a little compound a bit of wet sand and it's come out nice and shiny but I think there's still more to do to it I think we need to sand a bit more give it a little more compound polish and wax the whole car uh for now i think this is a wrap for today's video i hope you enjoyed it stay safe stay blessed don't forget to like subscribe and share